on the season. So when we've got kids you know, spaced on the floor who can shoot it and then they're willing to share it and pass it like that, that is a hard guard. Just I know playing teams like that in the past. Um, so we've, that's how we try to play and what we try to try to be in that attack mode for as much as we can. Question way back there. You guys had the 11 point lead at half, and it seems like you always kind of do this where it'll be seemingly a close game, and then you just score and score and score. Nothing super flashy, and suddenly it's a 30 point game. Do you ever look up at the scoreboard and almost find yourself surprised by how much you're up by? Um, well, you know, the first half they played really good defense, but I think at halftime we did a good job, you know, talking about what's going to kind of open it up and get us some good looks at the hoop. You know, like Trev said, getting in the middle of that zone really helped us out, spread the you know, floor open a little bit more, kind of condense them a little bit, got open shots for you know, Drew and Jay and Sam. You know, There's just so many weapons on the floor, a lot of three point shooters. You hey guys, can you talk a little bit about just getting back to the final, to the championship game? I know it's been a mission for you all season. And now that you're there, can you guys talk about it, Joey and, and Trevor? Yeah, that's uh, that's obviously a dream for everyone. Um, you got, you want to get to that state championship, and um, for us to do that last year, now again this year, that's that's pretty. Uh, not many people get to say they can do that. So uh, we have a really good opportunity in front of us tomorrow, and I think if we play our game, play the right way, and um, keep sharing it and knocking down shots, I think it's looking it's looking pretty good for us. Well, I think one thing that really helped us out is that. Throughout the season, we just kept taking it one game at a time. And we knew coming down here that we had to win that first game to get the second game, the one that we really don't want to play in. And then just, you know, playing by that kind of just helped us out a lot through the year, getting through all the games. Well, they do listen to some of the stuff I say. <laughs> uh, Scott and Trev, as you look at this last game that you'll be together, is it let's finish the job, or is it more we still have upside in this team? And if so, where is that upside? Well, we just talked about that in the locker room. That we hope that that this will be our best game tomorrow. That's what it should be, right? We should be trying to peak and, and play your best when your best is needed. Um, and I know tomorrow night our best will be needed. I will watch some of that Muskego game and uh, we followed a little bit uh, their their turn their tourney run. And that team is very tough-minded right now, and they're playing really good basketball. So I know we're going to have to um, go out and earn that tomorrow night. And as a competitor, who wouldn't want it any other way? I mean, you're in a state championship game. You want to play against a great opponent out on the Cole Center floor. And we've got that chance tomorrow night, and we look forward to it. Yeah, um, I think um, we're a pretty senior-heavy team, as you guys know. And um, we've been playing together for Eight, eight, seven, eight years now, and I think, like my dad said, that's it's our last game together. Um, we want it. We want to go out with a bang, and we want to play our best basketball. Um, like, like again, like he said, uh, Mosquito's a very tough team. Uh, they got some bigs that are gonna throw throw themselves around, and we're gonna have to match that. And that's gonna be a big boy basketball game tomorrow. And we gotta show up with intensity and match match everything they want to throw at us. Because they got they got a lot of weapons just like we do, and it's gonna be a great game. I think in terms of the, the nostalgia type thing of that, well, uh, yeah, I mean it's probably gonna be in the back of our mind. And last time with him and with this senior group that I've been working with since they were in fourth grade, but we'll have plenty of time after tomorrow night to enjoy some of those memories. Tomorrow night we want to make another one. Joey, can you talk last year, you were a freshman. This year, can you just talk a little bit about the difference for you um, and your ability to be maybe a little more assertive this year or maybe compared to last year when you were more maybe in the background? Uh, you know, last year, just, you know, I was just trying to, you know, I didn't want to be, I wasn't really aggressive. You know, this year I'm really looking to score more. You know, I really want to make us a better team and rebound more last year. I didn't feel like I rebound enough. And this year, you know, coming down here, it really just made it easier. Knowing that I already played here before, and it just, you know, it's really comfortability. Last year was you know, a lot of nerves and stuff coming in the first game, but this year, you know, it just, you know, it feels good being here before and worked out. We talked about trying to use that experience and and.
and uh, 